the channel. Happy to see you guys one more time. Well, happy to vlog for you guys one more time. Can't see you guys. But um about to go on a cruise right now with my boy Jordan. Um unfortunately I don't have any passengers to record this, so I'm trying to record as much as I can, but I gotta hurry up and get to the gas station. It's been a while since I filled this thing up. So gotta put some gas in this baby. And of course, of course, I gotta give you guys a cold start. <laughs> Thirsty, thirsty. Hasn't been fed in so long. Look at this shit. 464. God damn. What price is it where you guys are from? Whew. She's looking good. For being dirty for so long. Well, well, well. Look who finally decided to show up. And of course, also needing gas. But yeah, I had to go inside and get some water. I feel dehydrated right now. <laughs> Holy shit. But you know what, now that we're both here, I'm gonna give you guys a comparison of what our exhaust sounds like, and you guys let me know which one sounds louder. Oh, that's not Jordan. There he is. All right, first comparison, motor dyne exhaust with our pipes. Okay, he's actually tying up his clamp, so. First comparison, Tomy exhaust with our pipes. thousand rpms since we're in public all right here we go second comparison motor dyne exhaust hard pipes <laughs> there you guys go let me know which one sounded louder his car is tuned mine isn't i don't know if that makes a difference then again he doesn't have it on a map so uh yeah let me know what you guys think does the tomei win or does the mortar dine win let me know we got a first slow poke but look at these roads man they're fucking sick and twisty you guys haven't been highway nine you're in the bay area you guys are missing out jordan right there hopefully I have enough storage where it saves and I can get some clips for you guys. I'll try my best, but I'm gonna stop recording. <laughs> Alright, well, unfortunately, we have slow drivers again, but check this out, guys. Check this video out. Stranded in the middle of the road, waiting for a tow truck at the moment. So we're driving, jamming, having a good time. And then I see some shit in the middle of the road. I'm not sure what the hell it was. I try to avoid it, but you see how these roads are narrow. I couldn't really swerve to the side too much, or else I go off road and possibly total my car. So I tried to avoid as much as I could, and I guess I avoided successfully because nothing major happened to the car. Thankfully, I think it just hit the back tire. As you can see. Uh, no damage to the car, thankfully. Midi tire for the win. <laughs> Cause holy shit, I don't know what would have happened if I was lower and if I had to stretch that up. But nothing wrong. Knock on wood. Uh, and while we're waiting here, uh, 
Jordan's car took a shit. Uh, inspecting has coolant playing everywhere. So fuck that shit sucks. And to top it all off, we're trapped in this fucking smoke. This fire smoke. So hopefully the tow truck doesn't take too long and saves the G because who knows what the fuck went on. We do look pretty sick though. Parked hard out here on the road. Thankfully there's a call box here. And not only is there a call box, but there's a location so they can find us easily. Uh, one, one upside, this call box is like coming in clutch. I never thought I'd ever have to use one of these, especially in 2021. But Liz is okay. Everything looking good. Oh, thank you, Liz. Thank you for not taking a shit on me. Dude, actually, ooh. let me just make sure that it have a huge impact on my fenders. Okay. Like, oh man, that, that hit was hard. I'm, I'm fucking surprised I didn't go off road or some shit. That was a pretty hard hit. I thought for sure my side screw was gonna go fucking ripping off. But, have, dude, I'm telling you, if you're seeing how that shit looked like in real life, you'd be surprised nothing happened to my car. <laughs> my controller ended up flying out. Freaking. My airlift controller went flying out. <laughs> it was an insane hit. Ugh. I hate fucking trees now. Burn them all. I'm just kidding. Because of that, we're in more heat. See what the fuck it is. I got a. Uh, it says there's signal up there, right? Uh, I think there's signal right here. It just all fucking just starts shooting up the hood. Yeah. Good thing I got the vents and everything. I mean, yeah. there's just enough space between there to probably get through. All right, Jordan, how do you feel about this whole situation? Oh, pretty shitty. You know, we out here, we out here in the woods, you know. Just, <laughs> that homeboy right here decided to hit a fucking tree log and then my car decided <laughs> to blow up, so. You know, it's just going real it, good here. It was like, it's my time to shine. <laughs> he wanted all the attention. Yeah, my car is getting a little jealous. Yeah, it's like, it's like turn. <laughs> I want the attention now. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, there goes breakfast. <laughs> God damn. The tow truck is here. The tow truck is here. <laughs> With no huge delay. Thank God, because we're fucking steaming up. I'm already dark as it is. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure to follow the boy on Instagram. Trump's love in these hard times. Nismo game. See the benefit of real wheels? These were fucking fake wheels. That shit would have been a bent wheel for sure. Thankfully, nothing happened to the wheel, too. I just realized that. By that, I mean, like, they didn't scratch it or anything. Low problems. Hard to get the shit on here. My fucking driver has ultra boost on. There she goes. Nice and easy. Mission accomplished successfully. Ready to get that AC? I guess so. Man. Should be happy I have AC, man. Imagine if I didn't. Fuck. Cruising out here in the smoke, dude. It's heavy. Yeah. Oh, man. What a day. Okay, home sweet home. The Z's back to where it belongs. Holy shit, what a fucking day. I'm just glad my Z's perfect. It's okay. Considering the last time I took it out, <laughs> that shit with the fender happened, but man, I'm just glad nothing happened. It was fine, everything was good, the whole road. But literally, once we went downhill, everything went downhill. <laughs> it's cool though, got some in and out. I got to drop off Jordan, so. I'm glad I was there to help out a friend, at least. All right, real quick, guys. Sorry to drop the outro, but uh, I just wanted to take a second real quick. And uh, again, thank you guys so much for, you know, still supporting me. I know content is super slow right now and I haven't uploaded 
as much as, as I wish I could. But to be honest, like this year has been that great for me, um, especially financially. Last year, everything I did with the car, like it was a lot, you know, I spent a lot of money on the car. So this year I told myself, you know, if I can pump the brakes, take it slower and, you know, buy shit slowly, um, take my time, you know, just be financially better with my money just obviously but anyways yeah you know think smarter um unfortunately you know shit happened in life this year uh when i fucking fucked up my oil pan the shit cost it a lot dude like that oil pan was I, I couldn't find it anywhere and i had to be genuine from honda that costed me about six hundred dollars seven hundred something like that around there but with the labor and everything it Pretty much knocked me back like 950. That was like so stupid, man. And I took a chunk of my money, 950. You know, that's not something. Well, to me, that's not something I can just easily cough up. Um, and then, well, the next big purchase, the only big purchase I've done for the Z this year, is to get the BBK and get him powder coated. And that's the sad part. I didn't even slap it on just because you know. I mean, to you guys have been transparent, you know, I've told you guys about my life and, you know, I'm not going to hide anything from you guys. Like, this year, just financially, I'm just not stable and I'm kind of like at my lowest right now and financially, but um, I'm working on it. Uh, so, I mean, I'm not saying donate or like give me money or anything. Don't feel that bad. Like, you know, I'm doing fine. I'm, I'm afloat right now. I actually just picked up a second job and what? Well, I was supposed to start a second job back like in June, but like, dude, like the process for that shit has been taking so long that I have to look for another job while I'm trying to get that job. So technically I have like three jobs, but I started that third job um, at the beginning of this month because the second job that I got was supposed to give me a whole bunch of shifts this month and they canceled them all for whatever reason. So that put a lot of stress on me. So I had to start this third job just to, you know, feel better. And yeah, I mean, it's working out. Can't wait to start the second job, you know, cause that one, it's gonna feel a lot better starting that one. And I also forgot to mention, well, the part that sucks the most out of this year is just that my job has been randomly shutting down. So I've been getting like multiple days off. At first I was like, okay, well, you know, one day it's fine. It's cool to have like a nice break, but it kept being constant, like constantly. I'd be missing like two to three days, sometimes a whole week. So like, it, I was just haven't been able to like fully financially recover because of that. Like w once I'm like, okay, fuck, finally, like, you know, I'm starting to recover, boom, more shutdowns. And yeah, that's part of the reason why I got another job. Cause it's like, uh, right now with all the shutdowns, I can't really rely on just financially being good with my main job. So yeah, it just sucked. But like I said, I'm doing a lot better now, thank God. It really does suck, you know. Uh, that's part of the reason why I haven't really uploaded, because I'm just like, man, what, are you gonna, what am I gonna show you guys if I can't buy shit, or I can't spend money on my car to do shit? And you know, that's not really what I want. I don't wanna, and that's why I also knocked down my Instagram, I took it down just because I don't wanna focus on my car. I don't wanna like, you know, I wanna buy shit for my car, because if I'm on Instagram, I'm gonna wanna buy shit for my car. If I see a deal, I'm gonna want it for my car, and that's not where I wanna be. So I had to take a break from my car, just any car related shit, just cause you know, I want to be financially better. I want to get my money up. So, you know, I can be comfortable with my money, you know, then I can be comfortable buying shit for my car and hopefully not go crazy <laughs> like I did. Um, lesson learned, you know, modifying your car is fun, but at the end of the day, you know, you gotta be smart and make financial choices that'll not set you broke you gotta keep that in mind i know everybody wants all the nice stuff and everybody wants all the expensive shit but make sure you financially in your life are going to be good and don't just worry about your car you know but yeah like i told you guys uh, i'm open to you guys and hopefully you guys really understand where i'm at right now and you know you guys can come with some slack for not uploading that much i'm slowly but surely getting back to it again like I don't want to just upload random bullshit for you guys. I don't want to half-ass vlogs. And also don't want to stress myself out thinking that I have to buy shit. I have to show you guys, like, shit that I'm getting from my car. Like, it shouldn't be like that. Uh, at the end of the day, I want to vlog to have fun. 
not to stress i want to upload stuff that i want to upload to show you guys stuff that i would want to see you know at the end of the day it's vlogs for you guys to you know see me know about me and see what i'm doing with my cars and how i'm doing um it's not always going to be about buying expensive shit or doing expensive shit and that's pretty much where I have to get my mindset at, you know, not stress too much about just doing shit to my car. And hopefully you guys understand that. I know maybe I'm repeating my shit. I'm, I know I'm probably being really repetitive. I didn't really write this down or think about it. It just kind of came to my head. That I have to tell you guys how things are. And hopefully you guys understand, like I said, and Thank you guys again once again thank you guys so much for being supportive it's nice seeing the channel growing and getting all these views while i'm down but you know we'll get there guys i'm ready to start pumping out a lot more content for you guys thank you guys so much but hopefully you guys enjoy the vlog and i'll catch you guys in the next video i am the this heat is ridiculous and i still need to go to the gym all right guys catch you guys in the next video bye